The world is filled with stories of legendary heroes and treacherous villains. Of fantastical creatures and wondrous places where nature and magic live in perfect harmony. Not all stories have happy endings. But yours has yet to be written. Magic, both beautiful and powerful, binds together our long history. That common bond we share is the legacy of Hogwarts. Now it is time to add your own story to these hallowed halls and quite possibly shape the future of the wizarding world. Every corridor, every portrait, Every stone in this castle tells the story of witches and wizards who came before. Here you will meet lifelong friends and grow into your own magical abilities in the classrooms of the world's most talented professors. And while your journey begins at Hogwarts, brewing potions, Taming fantastic beasts and mastering spells. There is a larger world beyond these walls. A world filled with dangers you can't yet imagine. An ancient knowledge long gone from this world. strange and mysterious talent you possess may be the key to unlocking this dormant power. Your potential is limitless. But what form will it take? The journey ahead will reveal what you stand for. The choices you make now will define the legacy of Hogwarts. We have always known war. It forged our empire. Turned heroes into queens and kings. And decimated our foes. Now our oaths are lost. Forsaken. And you must face the monsters. Our sins have borne. Is an oath worth the weight of a crown?
face tyrants and would-be gods. Seen friends lose life and limb. But there's always someone bent on breaking the world. It's time for a new hero. No magic hand. No ancient prophecy. The kind of person they'll never see coming. We've got your back. I've got your back. Demons, dragons, dark spawn. Even the dread wolf. This is your story. Welcome to the Wonderlands, a glorious fantasy realm chock full of shooting, looting, and mystical, magical, smelly stuff. When you traverse these splendorous lands, it'll be up to you, dear traveler, to class up and save the day. Perhaps you fancy your hand at Stabamancy. It's less magic and more a way of thinking. Specifically, how do I stab that guy? Mayhaps by tossing out an ethereal psychic ghost sword? Stabomancers are all about creating and capitalizing on opportunities. Vis-a-vis -vis stabbing. Or should you prefer a less subtle approach, the Berserker is for you! See something? Smash it! See something else? Smash that! Unleash your frosty fury on foe after foe! Honestly, it's therapeutic. That's just a taste of what we've got in store for you. There are plenty more ways to play. Whatever your poison, we've got you covered. Welcome to the Wonderland! We all have our reasons for Babylon's tower to fall. But not everyone has the power to make it happen. You do. Your bond with the Gideon Coffin gives you strength. Powers. Control. The only thing you can't do is go back. What happened? The invaders arrived, started taking over the world, transforming it. Something's not right, I feel... I feel weak. You're still badly hurt. It'll be a while before you get all your strength back.
I believe there is no man who intentionally sets out to harm another. Yet the wounded and the conquered exist in droves. Such has it ever been. Perhaps the way of the world. Roland, closest friend of Sarah Noah Wolfort, is the younger prince of Glenbrook. As a member of the royal family, he must face both ideals and reality as war engulfs Norzelia. Does my life carry more weight simply because of the blood in my veins? I am not blind to your feelings, my son. I understand that my methods vex you. House Wolfort is obedient enough for now, but that can change as quickly as the wind. But how do we come to grips with our sorrow and anger? How do we atone for our mistakes? I assume their aptitude to be hereditary. But you can rise above this, seize your chance, and lay everyone's doubts to rest once and for all. Roland holds fast to his convictions. The blood of my friends spilt in my name. But the war challenges his values. Or hands now. And he is forced to make a bitter decision. Will you engage in dark deeds or bring them to light? Roland and Serenoa find themselves cornered after repeated clashes with enemy forces. Then, a neighboring nation extends a helping hand. In exchange, however, they request aid in their illicit salt trade. But how is that possible? However, if we let Sorcelay's advance continue unabated, I'm afraid retreat may be our only option. I would. You are familiar with Minister Sorcelay End. I would see Minister Sorcelay relieved of his position. Will you be party to illegal dealings for the sake of your nation? Let's take such shelter as we can find. Or expose them for the sake of your convictions? I see the salt matter is being addressed. A choice must be made. Meet new allies who share your fate. Your convictions will determine your path. That path will determine who joins your cause. Where will your convictions lead you? The future is in your hands. They suggest I am not fit for the throne? To victory! The heavens rain. I speak from experience when I say that the title of saint is not to be worn lightly. I use this. Even so, I will not falter. I will do what I can. Our ideals can only be realized by dint of strength. Grovel or bleed. Poor options both. For I am the second son of King Regna, Roland Glenbrook.